topic today we're really looking at is complacency versus content. And chapter four from Philippians is really what we're going to kind of go from, but I'm going to change it a little bit, and it's this. This is the end state for today. I want you to leave here thinking about what moves you from complacency to content. Why it's important for you to be content in how you live your life or what you live your life for. I think everyone worries about being complacent. And what we talked about in the, the, the passage we looked at, chapter uh, Philippians chapter 4, verses 11 through 13, we're really looking, you, you ground your contentment in seeing the world as it really is, uh, the good and the bad, um, the just and the unjust, but also getting your sense of meaning and purpose internally from one, either your faith in God, which is important, or from who are your teammates, and, and remembering that we're part of a larger team and that these external things, why they may be trials, that we can overcome them with our sense of sort of unique cohesion and chemistry. I always just want, want soldiers to, all, and I mean by soldiers, civilians, all of us to really think about how those small investments every day in our, whether it be our faith, um, for some it might be sort of their morals, their virtues, whatever you might want to call, you know, call it, but those small investments over time pay off because how we treat one another, um, how we think of ourselves, how we uh, build people up, how we give them honest feedback, all this impacts sort of our, our life and not only our life, but the people around us, our family members, our fellow teammates uh, here in the military. But, you know, we're changing lives, not just our own life, but generations from now because of what we say and how we treat one another. It's, it's so important. Thank you for what you do. And that's a takeaway that you can forget a lot about what I what I say today. But thank you for what the, the mission that Fifth Armor has. Because it's, I, I was one of the recipients of your type of training. Way a long time ago, I was a National Guard, a National Guard as a chaplain out of North Carolina. Went through something similar before Goliath to uh, before I came on active duty. So thank you for your investment in our soldiers and their families appreciate it. This host appreciates it and the uh, commanding general appreciates it.